Okay. So this is Google uh, Map. Let me start from the beginning. Okay. Pretty simple. Go to www.google.com slash maps. Okay. So it should pick up uh, from where you are. All right. So, okay. Then what you need to do when you want to customize the map is basically go to the save. All right. You may have something here. You may not have something here. Doesn't really matter. Okay. So over here, you have a number of tab and go for maps. Again, if you have not saved anything, you will be blank. Again, it doesn't matter because you are going to open my maps. All right. So right now, oh, I don't have any maps. See, no maps owned by you. Fine. I can always create a new map. So let me just click this. Okay. And where do I want to go? Mm, okay. Let's say I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to 45 Maxwell Road. Okay, done. Okay, so this is where I actually want to go. All right, so I can add to map if I want to. So now, okay, I have it over here. Okay, but beside that, look at the other things that I can do. All right, okay, look at all the other things that I can actually set. Okay, I can set another marker. All right, let's say uh from here okay so this is my maybe uh this is my mrt okay so let's say my mrt is over here all right so i will save this so now all right then i can look at the so now i got two points you can see what i actually have two points over here all right i can add lines add shape all right, or whatever driving routes or walking routes that I want. Okay, so let's say, all right, so click on the map to start tracing your route. So let's say this is my map and okay, and I want to go to, let's say here. Okay, so now I have this. I can set direction, okay, or I can measure the distance. So all these things I can actually still customize on my map itself. All right, so let's say, okay, then once I am done with this, okay, what can I do? Of course, I can bring the map or I can even uh, embed it. Okay, so this is not public. Later on, I need to set this to public. All right. Or I can just uh, set it to public okay, in my map area. And then I can, well, I can even print it. Okay, usually I'll print it because I usually like to carry uh, a, a physical map right, so that I know where am I walking to. Okay, so these are just some of the more advanced features that you can use for your Google Map.